Hello and welcome to Mimo Live TV. In this video series, we'd like to show you what's new. Mimo Live is the successor to Boeing's TV. And if you want to take part in the Mimo Live beta, go to the beta sign up page and enter your email address and you will receive a download link and a beta license right away. Now, first, let's take a trip down memory lane and have a look at how Boeing's TV used to look like. You might be familiar with this. So, this is the current version of Boeing's TV. But now let's take a peek into the future. Let's close down Boeing's TV and open Mimo Live. You already see the launch window looks completely different. What I'm doing now is creating a new document. As you already can see, we changed the user interface completely. We're now going to a left to right approach. On the very left hand side, you see the layer stack. In the middle, you see the settings of the currently selected layer and on the right hand side, you see the playout. If you want to access layers and sources, they slide in from drawers on the very left hand side. If you drag in something from there, dragging ways are very short. If you want to add a layer, just search for it, like for example station logo. You search for it, you drag it in and you enable it. That's how easy it is. In the upcoming episodes of this video series, we will show you how to work with sources, how to do live video streaming and much more. If you want to try Mimo Live yourself, just go to the beta sign up page and enter your email address. Like this, you will receive a download link and a beta license right away. If you have any feedback or questions, just email us or join us in the forums. Until then, see you in the next video. Goodbye.